Let me tell you something. Because there's definitely some, one I could find. Oh, there's yeah, a million of those <laughs> yeah. All you gotta do is go back to WCW late 90s. Yeah, yeah. Buck <laughs> Kevin Let Nash. me tell you something, <laughs> Rick Steiner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Bogan. Such a funny line, man. Yeah. Alright, you guys good to go? Yipper. Alright, glass half full, week 12, full <laughs> scene, take one. Welcome, sports fans, to week 14 of Glass Half Full. I'm your host, Johnny Gale, joined by my top-notch sports handicappers, Eric Easy Cohen and Nikki the Greek. The oh my God. <laughs> Rusty boys and Rusty boys. That's all good. Yeah. Welcome, sports fans, to week 14 of Glass Half Full. I'm your host, Johnny Gale. Nikki, tell him what you got. Mm -hmm. Nikki. <laughs> <laughs> that fishy line, Nikki sniffed it out, and I don't think these Steelers fans are going to be singing Wiz Khalifa on the way home from their road trip to Oakland. I tell you something. Actually, what you should watch, uh, there's some really good NFL films on the whole Big Ben, Eli Manning. Philip Rivers, fucking yeah, uh, top quarterback, yeah. and Eli wanted his dad making him not want to play yeah. for the Chargers. Wow. Mm. And you see Big Ben on the bus, literally just wow. taunting Eli, he's sitting behind him. <laughs> it, yeah, <laughs> him and his agent, like Eli's pretending to sleep because he's so pissed, like being there, like on all the media stuff. Like he's the same Eli. He's yeah, a little yeah, bit more yeah. of a shell and more of a shell. Yeah. And Big Ben's young, his young, fresh face, and he's just like, "You all right there, number one pick? <laughs> you gonna be all right?" Oh, it's the, most, it's the most this guy said all week. Uh -huh. This guy hasn't been talking all weekend. You can see how cocky Big Ben is. That oh my so gosh, like funny. so cocky. <laughs> and then, then they have him and his agent watching as the picks keep going. Yeah. Like, can you believe this agent literally says to Big Ben, he's like, can you believe Philip Rivers was picked fourth overall in the track? Oh my like, it God. seems like a movie. Like, yeah. like, this guy's playing the agent, but he is an agent. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> Eli was the one that whole orchestrated that whole trade. He yeah. wouldn't play. He wouldn't play for. That's uh, right. So they covered the all of that. They had to, yeah. They had to trade. They, they, the two of them were traded. And let's be honest, Eli's got two Super Bowl rings, but I think Rivers is the far better quarterback. I, I agree. I agree. Yeah. Why did he not want to play for? Uh, San he didn't Frank. want to play for the Chargers. Or well, San Diego. So yeah, small market. Play oh. his, his dad wanted him to be in a big market. Oh yeah. Apparently. Anything for fucking. Oh. Uh, you know, the Manning legacy. Somebody said, said somebody said, Archie, Ar 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 calls yeah, No, 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 but he, New York. No, New York. I know, but I mean, like, for, it's like, it's not like he said okay the same thing. But he was okay with Peyton going to Indianapolis. Oh, right, right. Yeah. But Peyton That's was I mean. first overall. Yeah. Yeah. Eli was, sure. would have been the same thing. But, uh, yeah. yeah. No, you're right. I, I don't know. What Maybe after he got drafted, he was like, all right, well, we don't want to deal with another small market. Right. And that's why I wanted to go You learned from that, yeah. Yeah. This is all still rolling, Eli? Yeah. Okay. Somebody, a lot of people, like, a comment that got a lot of likes was, uh, Archie Manning was LeVar Ball before. So <laughs> 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 That's hilarious. It's a new picture, boys, a yellow. There you have it, Nikki the Great, he gives you the goods. He makes sure that your pockets won't get filled up this weekend. Make sure you watch, you stay tuned, you st <coughs> Let's keep it rolling. Nikki the Great is out here. He's doing his thing. One of the most exciting personalities you're ever going to see. Outstanding. I meant to say also mixed with exciting. That's what he is. So for Nikki the Great and for Easy Cohen, I'm Johnny Gale. Thank you for watching. Yeah, I was, we got to do the... Maybe. Oh yeah! That was, that was good, but a little lengthy. A little lengthy in general with the rap. Yeah. What a week it's going to be. You're going to find out that these guys were on fire because that's what I've been seeing lately, especially from EZ Cohen. Nikki the Great is right back on track. Two out of three on his metal picks last week. I predict three out of three for both of them making six out of six. Yes, I can do math. So let me tell you. <laughs> that was good though. I like that. That's right. And that's why I'm fired up to sprinkle a little something this week because these boys they're on to something and I, when you sense somebody's on to something you don't turn your head and look away you listen you heed that advice you do <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>